five shocking rumoured endings to WWE SummerSlam 2018's main event. I have compiled a list of the five shocking rumoured ways the main event of SummerSlam 2018 is going to go down. And don't worry people, I've not clickbaited you. Wayne Rooney RKOing Brock Lesnar for the win is not on this list. There's actually some pretty good stuff on it. Can we get 100 likes on today's video? Let's do it. Let's get into it. Right, so number one, Roman Reigns wins, then gets attacked by a returning heel, Dean Ambrose. It was rumored a month ago that Dean Ambrose would be returning SummerSlam time as a heel. We're actually going to get mental, mental, chicken oriental Dean Ambrose. It was also speculated that he would be thrown into the Universal Championship feud with Roman Reigns after the summer. He should get injured more often. Some are hoping Ambrose returns to help his bro Seth Rollins in his match against Dolph Ziggler, but Nostra Kushni reckons a return for Ambrose at the end of SummerSlam's main event after Roman Reigns wins the Universal Championship would be far better. That would really get people talking, and the Monday Night Raw after would be huge. Number two, Roman Reigns wins with the help from Paul Bloody Heyman. Brock Lesnar is a bloody bellend. Attacking his manager Paul Heyman only a few weeks before the title match at SummerSlam, a bigger betrayal than when Daenerys Targaryen had sex with Jon Snow instead of Tom Cushney. This has made fans believe that SummerSlam could go down with Paul Heyman helping Roman Reigns get the win against Brock Lesnar with the interference from Paul Heyman. You dickhead. WWE officials will be hoping this move will help get Roman Reigns over further, but would this require Roman Reigns to turn heel at the same time? Let me know down below in the comment section. Number three, Kevin Owens wins briefcase, then cashes in. It's all a bit peculiar why Kevin Owens has the opportunity to win the Money in the Bank briefcase from Braun Strowman at SummerSlam. Are WWE thinking they made the wrong decision at Money in the Bank? Probably. A heel as the contract holder has always worked much better. It's rumoured Owens could win the briefcase earlier on in the night and then cash in on a winning Roman Reigns, so fans don't go home too disappointed. This would mean Roman is once again the underdog to the champion and nobody wants to see that. Number four, Braun Strowman cashes in during the match to win the championship. Braun Strowman never really did get a one-on-one -on -one match with the Beast for the Universal Championship. It was reported a few weeks ago that Strowman will be cashing in indefinitely in the main event of SummerSlam if the fans begin to turn on the match. Apparently, Strowman has been the backup plan from the start and he may be injected into the main event to save the show. It's about time he became Universal Champion. And number five, Brock Lesnar retaining the Universal Championship. Oh, for Christ's sake. The spasmoid Brock Lesnar is reportedly getting another short WWE contract beyond SummerSlam, but before his big UFC fight. It's expected he faces Kurt Angle in the coming months, and probably the biggest shock of the night and probably the biggest shock on this list is Brock Lesnar walking out still your Universal Champion. Ah, that'll be another six months before we see him again. Madeline McCann is going to turn up before Brock Lesnar. So there you go, people. Let me know down as a comment which one you would like to see end the show. And if it's none of them... Well, I've bloody bollocked it up then, and you guys should definitely comment down below how you would end the SummerSlam 2018 main event. There we go, people. I pretty much enjoyed doing this video. It was a laugh. Thanks for watching. Smash that like button. Subscribe if you're new around here. Check out these other videos. You can follow me on Twitter, Instagram, at Tom Cushney on everything. Take care. Spike your hair.